Boy, oh boy, oh boy. I'm annoyed that I woke up early just to watch this. This was the biggest waste of brain power I have ever witnessed. Dylan and Dennis, you've seen all the tweets, you've seen all the memes. Versus Logan Paul, neither are brilliant people. However, I wanted Dylan and Dennis to break his jaw. I think it was time he needed a bit of humbling, and instead Dylan and Dennis was an absolute embarrassment. I have absolutely no idea what he was doing. Watch this. Look how many security there is for Logan. It's pathetic. Dylan just stood there like a melon and did absolutely nothing. Look at all them. That is how the fight ended. <laughs> I mean, I just don't understand what he was doing. Literally, he threw more punches at the security guard uh, than he did for Logan in the entire fight. It was literally like clown versus clown. It, it, you know, I don't understand what he was doing. He's a bit of a small brain. He's clearly had some brain damage. This one, look at that guy. It was honestly a big waste of time. I'm sure you're all aware that wasn't the only fight we had to uh, put ourselves through. This one was the real fight. KSI versus Tommy Fury. Tommy Fury won by a decision by the judges. What do I think of the fight? <laughs> Uh, I thought it wasn't brilliant. KSI just hugs him and holds him. This guy is a professional boxer, so-called, and didn't manage to put him down. I mean, I just... I'm baffled. Like, I generally just don't know what I, what I was watching. KSI then threw a fit at the end of the fight, saying it was rigged, he was cheated, and that Tommy Fury didn't deserve to win. Uh, I think it's pathetic how it ended. It just shows that this YouTuber boxing is not real. It's fake. to the winner by majority decision. Tommy... Tommy Fury wins. Can't knock out KSI, but he does it and celebrates like he's won the bloody Champions League or he's just given birth out of his own penis. That's how of a major event this is for him. He says he's done with YouTuber boxing. I think rightly so. I think this just shows it's not a real sport. I actually found the fights unwatchable, especially the Dylan Dennis one. I'm not sure on God's earth what he was doing. He was trying to do like judo on him at one point. He kicked him. I mean, I just don't get it. I just don't get it. And he kept doing this. I mean, look, he goes down and then he tries kicking him there. He then gets up. And then, look, the security guard has to come in. And then he swings for him. I mean, you're going up against the Roy Dead for starters, you're not going to win. You're just not going to win, it's impossible. And then Dylan Dennis gets pushed into a corner like this. Look how many guards there are. It's truly a sad state of affairs, YouTube boxing. I think this is just drama. All the stuff that Dylan Dennis had done in terms of ruining Nina's life and, rep well, you know what I mean, doing all that, uh, it's all gone completely to put. He's truly truly a tragic figure what what what's next i think uh, ksi wants a rematch but i don't think that's going to happen you know i think it's completely over the whole fighting everything about it is, is done and i think it's about time jake pauls was there never forget who runs this shit tommy fury on the floor you know it's just tragic it's truly an embarrassment <laughs> look at jake in there <laughs> let me at him let me at him with my fucking frizzly fucking hair <laughs> i'm the boxing king no you're not you're a fucking bitch mate truly Truly, Dylan Dennis is never getting a fight again. That's how bad this was. Boom, puts him on his ass there. I mean, KSI wasn't happy, but can, can you blame him? I mean, so Tommy Fury won. Do you guys think it was rigged? Are they cheaters? I don't think they're cheaters. If it was going to be rigged, I think it would have been rigged for Tommy Fury, uh, for KSI, because, you know, it's his event. He could just pay him and say, I've got to win this. At the end of the day, though, Tommy Fury should have knocked him out. It's truly a tragic state of affairs. Logan Paul... I don't care about it. It was the biggest... Oh, that fight was so bad. Honestly, KSI just kept grabbing Tommy and Logan Paul just punched into his Dylan's guard and Dylan didn't throw anything. I'd love to see how many punches Dylan actually made because it must have been about 12. I can't see it being any higher. It was truly a sad state of affairs and I'm actually genuinely upset. I wait, waited up to watch this shit. It was truly embarrassing. But in terms of sports, it ain't a sport. He then shouted out Conor McGregor at the end. Conor McGregor, the Dylan Dennis' side. You know what? Me and KSI is an exciting, a juicy Knicks. I used to call them back when I was a plumber. Now I'm on the Lambo yacht. He's in a hurricane. Hurricane? Six round fannies own on OnlyFans. I'm the best.
Fest, baby. And there's a Lambo car. And this is a Lambo yacht, yeah? Gigs in the house. London shoot the house. I just can't believe Conor McGregor actually is watching YouTuber boxing. I mean, what has the world come to? It's truly a sad state of affairs. I mean, obviously he's a pro boxer. If I won, it's a mockery for the sport. It's how they see it. I've won it, bro. I won it. I got robbed. It's outrageous, bro. Minus point as well, bro. I was landing the cleaner shots. He couldn't get any jabs off. See, I'm all about you know if you lose, whatever. But don't go on then and moan. Look at your mouth, look at your face, look at your eyes. It's like we're in primary school. We've gone back to school and bickering like a bunch of 12 year olds. KSI is not happy. Exactly that, you know, Jake Paul's Jake Paul, but that was the biggest waste of time I have ever had to endure. It's truly a terrible, terrible, terrible boxing. I, I'm, I'm so dumb. I was actually excited for this. I was like, oh my God, Logan versus Dylan. KSI versus Tommy. This is actually going to be a good fight. And then when Dylan... Didn't do anything and it came to the end. I said, like, all right, maybe KSI will be a good fight. It, neither were good fights. I'm so done with YouTuber boxing. It's truly a tragic state of affairs.